Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's Hobbyland here doing three personal boxes of 2016 Futera Unique World Football slash soccer for John, for John P. Really appreciate it, John. Uh, comes from a fresh case as well, so let's pop this baby open. Let's grab three boxes for you. So I'm going to put uh, P. I'm going to put P right there just to indicate that these are personal boxes because we keep the personals separate from the. Uh, I don't think it matters too much, but just for just to, I don't know. We just keep it separate. All right, here we go. Okay, uh, so we're going to roll the die right here, and then we're just going to take the first three that we get. So there's box three. Box six, six will roll again, six will roll again, and box two. So we'll slide these boxes over here. Those personal boxes are available straight up for sale, jazpiecehobbyland.com, check it out. John, thank you very much for getting into this. It's funny because the first like dozen boxes we did, I don't think John ever got into any of these, any of the breaks. But more recently, I guess he's been excited about the prospect of a, uh, of a little soccer action. So he's been very excited about this. All right, so John, good luck. I love this Futera stuff. I'm a big fan of it. Big fan of the soccer. Uh, my club, Liverpool, with a big win over the title holders, Leicester. So I was very happy about that. So they're looking, uh, Liverpool looking good on their day. So hopefully they can keep it going this season. All right. There's the autograph right there already. So we're going to start off with Pedro. So three personal boxes for John P. Nice. We got the dual relic, Lom and Cole. Nice. I don't think this is one I haven't, I haven't seen one of these before. Nine out of 49, Philip Lom and Ashley Cole. Nice. Ashley Cole, who's with the, uh, with the, um, whatchamacallit, uh, Galaxy now, I believe. And there's Alex Song, Elite Autograph. Two out of 30. Nice, and the next one. It was a big win over Leicester. They're the title holders. Prestige World. There's Shevchenko. Even though they, they haven't started off the season like title holders. Dual relic, and look, this relic is about to about to pop out of there. Nice. Alexi Sanchez and uh, Zamorano. 12 out of 50. Nice. National heroes, two, the two Chileans right there. Very nice. What, even, the, even their coach said they don't have a chance? Well, not to repeat, but they're still title holders. They should still, you know, their team hasn't changed that much. There's Johan Cruyff, Heritage. That's 27 out of 50 on that one. Nice. And another nice dual relic coming up. 
There's Frank Lampard and Xavi. I like the color in there on that Xavi. 40 out of 49. Where did that come from? That's from a piece of Xavi's Barca game-worn shirt from a La Liga match back in 12-13. Medrano says what? Le Leicester's focusing on the Champions League? Oh, we'll, see, we'll see how they do there. Yeah, well, Leicester obviously did not have, other than cup competitions, they did not really have much to do in Europe, obviously. So they were able to field pretty much the same strong lineup throughout the, throughout last year's campaign. But this year, obviously, a little more juggling involved. There's Marichal. Two out of 11 on United, of course. There's Carlos Devez and got these guys and this guy right here, Mario Gotze, then and now part of big transfer rumors over the summer, the summer window, 15 out of 55. I think a lot of Liverpool supporters like myself thought that uh, he would end up in a Liverpool shirt, but no, he did not. This is from a Germany away a game-worn shirt from an international friendly versus England and a piece of his Bayern Munich uh, away shirt right there. There you go. Nice color in there. Excellent. That was box one. Here is box two. We do have random letter uh, breaks of this that come from a different six-box inner. So if you want to do a random letter break of this, only $17.99 gets you a random first name letter, you know, and a chance to get some big hits. Yeah, Paul de Jong is like, that's a fun patch for Xavi. I don't re I don't remember those, the a, a polka dot pattern in their shirts. But it's, th it's there, there it is. It must have been like a third kit or something, wasn't it? Maybe, maybe not. Ross Barkley. And there's Andriy Shevchenko and Blokin right there. National heroes. Nice. I like this texture right here. And the color on this side too. That's very nice. Two out of 50 for the Russians. Nice. That's one of Blokin's USSR game-worn shirts from a match versus Ireland. Nice, in 1984. Nice, both, both Kev California and Prestige World saying almost at the same time, the polka dot is their team-issued underwear. Fair enough. There's Klaus Jan Huntelaar. There's Thomas Müller, 11 out of 50. Nice. There's Memphis Depay. There's Pele. And the relic is Mr. Shakira, Gerard Pique. Raiders. Ballsy Jack Del Rio, too. I like that move. There's Gerard PK relic right there, folks. I got I got I got nervous a little bit. Fifty-seven out of fifty-nine. <laughs> I know it did. I was like, and then, and then I was, I, I saw what you see the ref on the right side went no, and the ref on the left side looked at the guy to his right. He wasn't sure either. <laughs> it was a really good game. I'm, I'm glad. Uh, Pittsburgh. You know what? Washington's not looking that bad. No. What are you saying? Pittsburgh? Uh, I Washington. think I think they're in Washington, okay, maybe. Okay, I'm going to take Washington, and I'm going to take the Rams. Yeah, I'll take the Rams, too. Okay. Might as well. You know what? Because the Niners, too much controversy, and somebody wants to pop um, Kaepernick. That's true. Hey, everybody in every squad going to want to pop him. That's right. That's true. Uh, we've got Marquinhos right there. Eden Hazard. That was our, that was Dennis. Our, uh, our our male guy from the U.S. Postal Service. He's a good dude. 
I think I think he enjoys the fact that we're probably the only stop that he has on his mail route that is like as big of sports fans as he is. So so he always ends up hanging out here for a little bit, which is nice. Karim Benzema, two color patch, and a piece of the match day program. Twenty eight out of ninety nine. Nice Karim Benzema and the autograph. That's a nice one. 32 out of 35, Matteo Darmian. The defender, the Italian defender. There you go. Nice piece of the match day program and his autograph. Nice, there's, there's almost like a calligraphy sort of look right there. Nice auto. And the last mini box from this box. And then we have got one more personal box for John. Paul DeYoung saying Man City will win the league. Yeah, I mean, even without a healthy Sergio Aguero, it seems like they can always still, still uh, they have the depth to keep winning. Tony Cruz, 10 out of 11 on the Tony Cruz. Like I said, folks, we have one box, random letter breaks of this, only $17.99. There are the rest. Christian Eriksen. Spurs, I think, right? On the Christian Eriksen? Is that where he plays now? 33, oh, yeah, yeah, Spurs. From a, this is an FA Cup match right there, Arsenal. 33 out of 59. There you go, nice. Madron, you want to put a friendly wager for the for the match on the sixteenth? What is this? Wait, Madron, you're a, you're a Chelsea supporter, right? Is this the Liverpool Chelsea match, or is this? Are you Arsenal supporter? I forget which one it is. I know you're in London somewhere, right? One of the one of those teams. Robert Phillips says Jose Mourinho will help Man United win like he did for City. Well, it is pretty exciting to have both of those managers up there. Should be an exciting season of good sound bites and, and whatnot, especially from, from Jose, of course. Ricardo says Real Madrid greater than everybody else. Might be debatable. Yeah, um, I did see a little bit of the uh, the Manchester Derby. City does look pretty good. All right. Carlos Baca starts us off. There's Daniel De Gea. There's Sergio Aguero for uh, Man City. Guy seems to get injured all the time, but doesn't seem to matter for Man City. And speaking of Manchester United, there's Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Even though it, you know people wanted him in the Premier League a lot earlier when he was a little bit younger, but even at his quote-unquote old age, seems to be still producing. 12 out of 32. Now, this these kit cards are cool. They feature... A piece of his uh, Ajax game warrant shirt from a Champions League match versus Arsenal back in 2003. Also a piece of his AC Milan game warrant shirt from a UEFA Cup match uh, again versus Spurs back in 2011. And a piece of his AC Milan game warrant shorts from the same game. Very nice. These kit cards are really cool. I love those. All right. Next one. Remember, we have more personal boxes available. JazzPeaceHobbyLand.com if you want to check that out. And um, for $17.99, you can get a random first name letter for this. So it's a little bit of a less uh, inexpensive way to get in on the action. There's James uh, Rodriguez. 8 out of 11 on that. Oh, Robert Phillips says he went to the City United Derby. And as a United supporter, not a good day. No, must not have been for you. And I've heard of this guy, Pele. This card features a piece of Pele's Brazil away uh, game-worn number 10 shirt from an international match from the early 60s. That's from the early 60s. How cool is that? 54 out of 59. So, for example, 
for fifteen dollars or for seventeen dollars ninety nine cents in a one box break. If you got randomized letter P, this historical relic right here would be yours. It'd be that easy. Nice, Todd say he found out on the Futera site that his Pele out of 32, uh, there, there are only, what, 25 released on an out of 32? Yeah, a lot of, a lot of these are pretty short printed as well. There's our Arturo Vidal, 44 out of 50 on that one. There's David De Gea. And the hit is Sesc Fabregas relic and a piece of the match day program, 17 out of 99. This is from his Arsenal shirt uh, versus Wigan in 2011. Nice. And the last mini box for John. The last mini box from your third box. What is, that a, is that a mythical? Could be. Looks like it. It is, so that'll replace the autograph. And the mythical is, who is this? Uh, it's three out of five. It's Dino Zoff. Wow. Featuring an actual tournament program for the 1982 World Cup, where he represented Italy. Wow. These mythicals are really cool. Let me zoom in a little bit closer on this just so you guys get a better look at the detail. Now, from my understanding, these are these are also made out of like 18 or 24 karat gold or something like that. Plated, obviously. But still very nice. Excellent. John, that's a train whistle to end your series of personal breaks. Congrats. Thank you very much, John. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo! Thanks, everyone. Personal boxes available at jazbeeshobbyland.com and one box random letter breaks available on jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is Joe. We'll break more footy with you next time.